All right, everybody. Back with part nine for Tomb Raider 4 here. We are back in the trenches, but we are looking for a level called the Street Bazaar. And I think we have to go through the trenches just to get to it. Because there's a few unexplored areas here. We also have a key that I have to use to something that we picked up in the last part. I think it's called the Rooftop Key or something like that. Roof key, yeah. I don't know what this is used for. We also have our weapon code key. I think this might prevent the turrets from shooting at us, but I'm not entirely 100% sure. Yeah, I did notice that we can climb the ceiling thing there. So maybe that's where we're supposed to go. We do have a few pickups nearby, and when we do get to the street bazaar, there will be one secret that we can get, which would put us at 60 out of 70. Um, and then there's probably some more secrets in the Citadel level that is also still a part of this chapter. So we're going to have to see how it goes. But yeah, we're still trying to figure out what we're supposed to do to the beast that's in the center of the city. Uh, we haven't killed it yet. We're still trying to gather all the pieces to take that thing down. Don't know where Von Croy is yet. We haven't seen him since we got here, basically. And uh, yeah, I think we're pretty much all set here. I think we're ready to go. I can already hear some enemies walking around. Maybe I should get my shotgun out. Is there anyone over here? I can hear them, but I have no idea where they're at. Are they? Ab I wonder if they're above me. Here's one of them. There's another one. That other guy must be above us. But let's head back here. I think I actually walked by some of our pickups. I think we've got some pickups somewhere in here. Huh. Here we go. Huh. Large medi pack. <laughs> Thanks, look mode. That helps. Oh, okay, we can just fall down. This leads somewhere. Some pickups right here too. Some arrows. Barely see them. I only saw them because of the arrow heads. You can shimmy through here. Oh shit, what's this? Well, that's blocking us. Um, the one thing that's so tricky about these games is they added the ability to shoot stuff down. Yeah, there we go. Now I just gotta climb all the way back around. Alright, here we go. We can make it through now. Probably getting closer to our enemy now as well. There's our climbable ceiling. 
Oh, great, and locusts. Really don't understand the point of these enemy types. They just fly in and hurt you and then leave? Because, yeah, I don't know if you can really do anything about it. Oh, hello, sir. Oh, he actually dropped a medipack for us. He has our next pickup. Well, this is a strange looking wall. Oh, here's what our roof key is for. Oh man, it looks like we can maybe shimmy across in front of us. I'm still hearing footsteps though, so there's even more enemies somewhere. Here's our enemy. He's dead. Am I supposed to shoot this too? Of course I can't get the crosshair directly on it. <laughs> well, actually I won't need to if I just... No. Use the explosive crossbow instead, right? I don't know if they actually have to do anything with this. Hmm. Seems weird that they'd give you this, like, little hole to peek through. <laughs> it's just not a perfect axis. Whatever. I don't know if we can do anything with that. I'm gonna just make a save up here and then explore a bit. So let's see what else we got down here. I always gotta remember is I think you always have to do this if you want nitrous again. Oh shit, well this is something. I really hope we didn't have to hit that button though. We can climb up here. What the hell was that? <laughs> I, I can't use look mode, I can just do this. Is it supposed to be lightning or something? Because I'm hearing thunder, but now we are in the street bazaar. So we finally found our level here. That was a higher fall than I was anticipating. We actually do have three pickups in this room, apparently, as well. Put your gun away. Aziza sent me. Uh, help me, English. Uh, I bleed to death. I try to hide, but those things smell the blood on me. I've come for the mine frequency. I need to get back to Aziza through this rabbit warren, with both legs intact. <laughs> I do a good job with the mines. Huh? Not that it does us any good. We are all dead or half dying. 
Where are the rest of you? I need the explosive codes. Saida, my colleague, lies across the roof bridge in the mosque as we retreated. Something new that we had not encountered before came from the shadows like lightning and took his head. The codes? Ah, inside his head, inside the creature. I need those codes. Search his body. I don't know. Leave me now, for I am weak and wish to prepare myself for my god. Alright, well here's our first pickup. Uh, thank you, man. And, uh, Von Croy's men aren't doing so hot. Unless those aren't his men, these are just the local militia or something like that. But they look similar to the soldiers we've been killing. Got two other things we can pick up in this room, though. Oh, here's one of them. It's in like the perfect pixel spot that I can't just walk to. Here's our next one. Alright, um, what are these things? One of them looks kind of like a... Like here's a handle. Car check? Why does it have all this stuff in here? Here we go, we just made a car jack. Push the big red button. We have another pickup in here as well. Is there something in here? No. Alright, I guess we're just heading up. She has to let go of the flare. Okay, not sure how she wasn't able to grab the ceiling there. It looked climbable. There we go. Worked that time. Not sure what happened the first time. Oh. Kicked me off right there. Okay, take we have to do something with the grate above me. Um, oh, alright, our interaction brings up our menu here, so we probably have to use this. Alright, nice and simple. God damn it. There we go. Oh, that looks safe. Oh, god damn it. More locusts. We can move these. Well, at least that. We can move this. Yes. Oh, well, we gotta probably push one of these into the lightning. I'm wagering it's the bigger thing. Oh, shit. <laughs> Wanna be that close?
There we go. Wasn't letting me do anything at first. had the lightning work for us basically how did that move it well, anyways after we do that our first secret is actually coming up here I think it's gonna be right up there somewhere just gotta figure out our way over there this is actually gonna be the only secret in this level too and it'll put us at 60 out of 70. Only 10 more after it. Though we still have a pretty decent chunk of levels to get through. So even though we only have 10 more secrets, we're not we're not at the end almost yet. Oh, it's gonna make me have a weird camera angle here. There we go. Yep, here's our secret, greeted by a nice group of locusts, who are just tearing us to pieces. At least they gave me a large medipack. So let's heal again. I guess we can heal with the large medipack it just gave me. Now let's see if we can find our way forward here. Ooh. Oh, thank god this isn't a slide. I didn't even have to be as cautious with the jump there. I moved forward a little bit too much. Oh, that's... That was just great. I could not see how far down that drop was. Damn it. Alright, there we go. Okay. I have a pickup somewhere to our right here. Oh, is this our friend? Oh, yep, he is headless. So he did get messed up. Up. Oh, Jesus Christ, that's what that noise was. Well, I'm assuming since he's here, we have to use him in some way. I can't never, I can never get a jump off fast enough. Where the hell is he going? Whatever. Just gonna have to let him hit us. I didn't even see that guy at first. Actually, it's just a wall jutting out. Oh shit. Oh, alright. Actually, a safe fall for some reason. I was expecting to be dropped somewhere. Where are we right now? Oh, we're back in the trenches? Okay, oddly enough... 
Our next pickup is through the area we kind of just went through, so I think I'm going back into the street bazaar. Um... That was over this way. Can I even get back up there, though? The only way I hit up there before was... With the bike. Oh, shit. That was a long drop. Yeah, it was, like, right up here. How am I gonna do that? Oh, there we go. Because this is where my bike is. Yeah. I wonder if we're gonna be trying to go through there or something. Let's head back up. Right, now that we're back in... Oh! This door wasn't open before, was it? We never went through here. You hear footsteps. Yeah, here's our pickup, though. More oozy rounds. <laughs> the door over here. Okay, this is getting confusing. This is a new area? What area is this? Oh, we're in trenches again. Is this supposed to be our, uh, our minefield? We have that frequency thing, right? Oh, okay, there we go. So, we can just jump in, right? Oh, okay, there we go. That's how we open the door. Okay. I don't know why it does that sometimes. Sometimes it just takes off. Oh, where did this guy come from? Before I keep going though, let me uh let me equip it with nitrous. Just in case. Night camera. Whoa, shit. Thought there was gonna be landmines at first. Alright, random gators. Am I still going the right way? Oh, God. Not that thing. I think we're trying to get our friend. Lara, and you handle yourself pretty well, Sergeant. You've got the codes? What now? After all we've been through, I think not. 
this is merely insurance. Against what? Against you stopping me from doing my duty. Somebody needs to drive that truck in there. Kamikaze. Whatever it takes for my country. In the next life, then, my friend. Okay, he just sacrificed himself and took that thing out. I like how they park right in front of it, though, and just sit there and have a chat. It's like, yeah, right, dude, that thing would have lit me on fire in, in no time if I would have done that. But, uh, I think we're in the Citadel now then, right? Yeah. Um, the Citadel has two secrets, so that'll put us at 62 out of 70 if we get them, which we're going to. All right. See what awaits us in here. Thank God you made it. Von Croy. I saw it myself. I would not believe such a thing. He's possessed of Set. Get out of here, Sean. I have a feeling things may turn nasty. He's digging under the citadel, into the Crusader's vaults, in search of the ceremonial tablet. The tablet which contains Set's binding incantations. Be careful, Lara. I fear there are things in the vaults man was not meant to see. I'm not a man, Jean, and I'm always very, very careful. Oh, we finally got another glimpse of Von Croy. Now he's got undead crusader knights on his side, so that's, that's just great. He also rescued our friend, finally. But he is still one step ahead of us here. Right, what do we all have? Nothing back here. Got a staircase. And a lever. <laughs> Damn it. Perfectly aligned lever. Okay, that opens our door. Do you have a pickup? Oh, it's a torch. Why do I need this? Aha, okay. I was gonna say, is it gonna be like our boulder rope?
Oh, we can't set this one on fire? Interesting. Um. Oh, weird. Which way does it want me to go? We do have a pickup right here. First secret's actually coming up. I think it is in this direction. Here's another pickup. Right, he's just waiting to hit that lever, I guess. But uh, I think our first secret is to our left here. I think we want to go somewhere up here. Yeah, there's a crawl space on the right here. Might be kind of hard to see. There we go. That's one out of two. Grab both of these. All right, now we have another pickup right beneath us somewhere. ledge right there. Is that where I had to go? There's a crawl space right there too. Oh, let's keep going this way instead once. Oh, no, there's our pickup. I think we might have to go that other way though. Oh, there's a way we could swim down right there too. Get to that crawl space, though. Oh, there's a ledge right here. We're just gonna have to do a lot of shimmying, I guess. Hopefully, we don't get set on fire. Okay, good. <laughs> I could see that happening. <laughs> they always tend to try to do that to you. Still making our way. Half of our body's in the water. Surprised that doesn't just kick you off into the water. Was it, this isn't a secret. This seems like it'd be a secret. I guess this is primary path. Seems pretty well hidden. Oh, yeah, here's another pickup. Oh, is this a slide? Shit. Okay, that was sketchy. Here's another pickup, though. God, man. Is this what this level is gonna be like? Just a bunch of tricky parkour and platforming?
I feel like we just head into the water now, right? Or is there a... Actually, wait. Before I jump down, let's try forward. Yep, okay. I was gonna say I could barely see a ledge, but... Oh, shit. Alright, he's dead. Came out of nowhere. Oh, wait a second. I don't want to get like two pulls and have him trigger something. <laughs> well, <laughs> he ain't triggering anything anymore. But then again, do we have to hit the level? Shit, there's someone behind me. Wait. Why would I want to do that, though? Shit, well, whatever. Oh, are we gonna be able to survive this? Okay, barely. Oh. Here's our next pickup. Is this where the flames are active? Um, let's go this way. We got a whole puzzle chamber here. We also have some pickups in our corners. Some more grenade launcher rounds. I don't remember what the yellow tipped ones were called. Is there anything in this corner? No. Small medi pack. God damn it. Another set of grenade launcher stuff. Alright, what do we got here? Alright, these are movable. Okay. South. Alright, so it's north, south, east, and west from what I can see. They all have letters on them. But... Is it just going to be normal? We came in from this side, so is this the south side of the room? I guess there's only one way to find out. Let's move all the pieces. Should go there. East is kind of already right next to where it goes. Before I put north where it needs to be though, it would block south, so let's not do that. Oh, shit. Can I move it this way? Oh, okay, nice. Just enough room. Uh. Hopefully this is right.
Okay, seems to have done something. I saw something open over there. Did that open all passages? It does look like our next pickup is somewhere down to our left here, though. So I guess we're going this way first. Oh, giant hole in the center there. Yeah, here's our pickup. Walk too far. Oh, how come it looks like... I don't even know if I should trust that. Oh, there's actually water down there. We do have a pickup somewhere down here as well. Just getting stuck on everything. Let us into here. Yeah, here's a pickup. Well, that leads us back up there. We do have another underwater pickup somewhere. So let's head back in once. I'm getting stuck on nothing sometimes. Must be a different passageway somewhere in here. Oh yeah, right here. If I could swim through it. Yeah, I can see the pickup on the floor. We also have a lever right here that I can't seem to pull. We're gonna drown. <laughs> can't pull that lever for some reason. Oh, here we go. I just shut something. We're gonna have to use some medi packs. There we go. Very, uh, very nice camera angle. Alright, so now that we did that, I don't know what that actually did for us, but we got our pickup. Let's head back through here now. Do you have that other passageway we can still explore? <laughs> oh shit. Well, that actually got both of them. Um, okay, that did something with the water again. There were a few trap doors in there, so maybe one of them's open now. I guess we're gonna have to check.
Um. Which way did we go before? Oh, here's another lever. I didn't even see this passageway. are open. Some more pickups. Stuck. Nothing in that one. Oh, the water's actually completely drained out of here now. Jesus. Hang on, buddy, let me get up there. I think he might have actually... Did he have a pickup for us? Weird, it's listed that he has an enemy pickup, but I didn't... I'm not seeing anything. Unless it fell. No. I think one of the... I think there's just discrepancies in the versions or something like that, because... There's been a few pickups that haven't been ex where it said it that they were, so I don't really know what's going on with that. Well, shit, here's our zombie crusaders. Oh, god damn it. Did not know that was there. Alright, I'm back around to our friends here. Can we kill these guys? Oh, shit, no, we can't. At least, how is that? Can't break that. Okay, weird. My pickups are in this direction, though. So how the hell do I get through here? It doesn't even look like there's a way through here. Oh, okay, they can break it. I was just, that's why I was standing there. I was just gonna see if they could. Right, let's see if we can get past them here. Hopefully they can't climb. Actually, I do have a few pickups in here as well. Yep, here's one of them. And there's another one across from me. More flares. Now we have this whole chamber to explore. Alright. Made a save here. I also had to reload because I accidentally finished the level. Our last secret is in here, but when I was looking for it, I accidentally triggered the end. I think our last secret is right down here. Yeah, here we go. Gotta crawl through here. Keep going this way. There we go. Final secret for Citadel. I think this is the final secret for uh, Cairo as well. God, it's so noisy. They must be in here with me. Oh shit, yep. 
Can't even grab that. Grab these revolver bullets. There we go. Should be everything in here. Alright. We are technically done with Cairo now. We just have to leave. It's right here. We should be at 62 secrets. Yep. So we're on track. And in return? I will grant you vigor as those around you fall. You shall command the ultimate power, that of life or death, over those you choose at your side. And in return, they will bow at your feet and give worship. Got my fair share of that already. And besides, give a jackal your hand, and he'll bite off the whole arm. Barking mad. <gasps> all right, just throws us into the next level, too. But all right, we, uh, that was a little bit of revenge right there. Wow, this place looks crazy. But, um, we trapped him in with the amulet of Horus, just like he trapped us. We actually probably have that in our inventory now, too, right? Yep. It's back in our possession. That was one of, like, the first key items we picked up. But, alright, we should be in the Sphinx Complex. I don't know if this level is considered a Cairo level or not, but we should be in the final chapter now. There's also one secret in this level as well. I think we're going to squeeze this level in for part 9. God, I hate how it always defaults me to my pistols here. Alright, they're dead. Oh shit, this better not be a slide. Okay, good. Get our pickup. If that was a slide, I would have not been able to do anything. Alright, they're dead. We have a couple of pickups out here. Okay, or just don't grab it. Yep, here's one of them. Here's our other one. came from we have a switch over there these pits oh yeah they are shit gonna have to be kind of careful then There we go. Passageways open. I hear more footsteps. Oh, it's one of the spinning blade dudes. Where the hell is he going? Uh. 
Buddy, can you stop hopping around for like two seconds? Alright, he doesn't have anything for us. Alright, well now that we are through here, I think we're actually in the area of our... First secret, or first and only secret for this level. I think we want to go this way. Ooh, can we grab that ledge? Okay, yes. Yes, we can. I think we want to continue left here. We also do have a pickup right here. Okay, we're getting shot from long distance. Let's get rid of him right away. I don't even need to go up that way, we can probably just do this. Bunch of crates in this room. I think this one has a pickup. Yeah, some ammo clips that I can't seem to step on. There we go. So there's a vent underneath that book, or behind that bookshelf. Can we move this? Man, all of this is for our secret still. There's a pickup right there. This dude's just hiding in the shadows. I'm just trying to pick up the shells. There we go. What is this? Oh, it's like a metal plate. It looks like a piece of paper at first. I think our secret is underneath one of these bookshelves, though. Actually squeeze through? Oh yeah, we can. Yep, here we go. There, we're, there it is. The one and only secret on the Sphinx Complex. Nothing under that crate. Push this button now. Alright, they're dead. Gonna need some health. <sighs> now I think we're just heading back. And I think we're going the other way now. Whoa, shit, that auto-corrected me in the worst way possible. Let's try this again. There we go. Yeah, I must have hit like a brief part of the slide or something like that because it tilted me in the worst way possible. Um, shit. I wonder if I can make this. Oh, okay. <laughs> Just barely.
All right, we're out of there. You have a pickup somewhere back here. There's also that thing. But our pickup is in this direction. Oh, great, more of this. Is this a landable platform right here? Oh, great, more of these guys. Guys, can you give me a sec? Jesus Christ. I think our pickup's gonna be in one of these. Just a stick? Is this Von Croy's cane or is this a stick? Kind of looks more like a cane, doesn't it? Does it actually say? Wooden handle. We can combine it. Oh! All right, there we go. We got ourselves a shovel now. We do have another pickup on top of this thing, too. Widespread shotgun ammo. I'm not really sure what the point of some of the ammo types are in this game. Widespread shotgun ammo didn't seem much different than normal shotgun ammo. The inscription reads, One night in dreaming came to me the spirit of the sphinx in his passing he spoke unto me words of great wisdom tutmosis here is your true destiny this land of egypt is forever yours to rule in return Protect me, always, from the sands of time. As you are, I must be free from head to toe, so that we both may see the divine beauty of creation. So right next to the real Sphinx, come across numerous Sphinx statues in the previous games. Alright, so is this supposed to be like a gravestone? Jumping down. Sands of Time. That makes me want to play Prince of Persia. Alright, I think we're officially in the next level. Why did that gate open? Alright, sometimes they throw enemies at you right away. But, let's see what we are in now. Underneath the Sphinx. Alright, so we are in a new level now. But, I think we're going to end part 9 here. I kind of just wanted to fit in that next level. There is one other secret in this level. So that'll put us at a total of 64. Yeah, we're, uh, we're in the last chapter now. We're getting pretty close to the end. I think, at least. Still seems like there's a pretty decent amount of levels to go, but we'll find out. Not sure how long they're gonna be. Some will probably be longer than others, but it's this game, it's very hard to gauge how long it's gonna take to do something, where I kinda could in the previous games. Usually it was like one to one level here and there was really long, but usually I could average two levels per part and even it out at about an hour. But this game, there's so many tiny levels and big levels on and off that it's just a little bit tougher. But yeah, underneath the Sphinx. So we're now underneath the real Sphinx, or we're interacting with the real Sphinx, not a bunch of the fake ones we saw in the other ones that were just randomly in underground chambers and stuff like that. But 
Yeah, this game's still really good. It's actually getting better the further in you go. I actually liked the Cairo level. There was some annoying parts to it, obviously, but it, it's weird because with the beast in the center of the city and stuff like that and having to find the pieces to take it out, it felt very Resident Evil all of a sudden for some reason. And then, yeah, it just... Uh, it was a it was a neat level design, I would say. Very confusing in some parts, but that's just... As I played through these, that's just par for the course for Tomb Raider, at least the classic ones. But yeah, I'm excited to see where this goes and how Von Kroy is going to get himself out of his chamber that he's stuck in now. Then again, he has an army on his side where we didn't, so we just had to find our own way out. But we'll find out in part 10, I guess. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you there.